Welcome to our channel, today we are going to explore failed aviation designs in history. The Saunders Row SR.53 was a British aircraft designed in the early 1950s as an interceptor that could reach high altitude at supersonic speed. It was a unique design that featured both a rocket engine and a jet engine, which were meant to work in tandem to provide the necessary power to reach high altitude quickly. The project was first initiated in 1947 by Saunders Row a company known for producing flying boats, in response to a Royal Air Force RAF, requirement for a high-altitude interceptor. The SR.53 was powered by a Bristol Siddeley rocket engine that could provide the initial boost to get the aircraft to altitude quickly. Once at altitude, the Armstrong Siddeley Viper turbojet engine would take over and provide sustained propulsion for the aircraft. The SR.53 was designed to fly at Mach 2 speeds and at altitudes of up to 65,000 feet. The design also included a delta wing with a canard foreplane, which gave it excellent maneuverability at high speeds. However, despite promising initial testing, the project was ultimately cancelled in 1958 due to a number of technical and financial issues. One of the major problems was that the rocket engine was unreliable and prone to catastrophic failure, which led to several accidents during testing. The aircraft also suffered from stability issues at high speeds, which made it difficult to control and increase the risk of accidents. Furthermore, the cost of developing the SR.53 was becoming increasingly expensive, and the RAF was losing interest in the project. By the time the project was cancelled, only two prototypes had been built, and the design was deemed too risky, 